Hello everyone! Welcome to my channel, Math is Fine. I am Teacher Shea Wheel. And for those who are new in this channel, don't forget to subscribe, like and share this video, and click the notification bell so that whenever I uploaded a new video, you will be notified. Stay tuned! Our lesson for today is all about rounding decimal numbers to the nearest hundredth and thousand. Among the eight planets in the solar system, Mercury is the smallest and closest to the Sun with an orbital period of about 88 Earth days. Seen from the Earth, it appears to move around its orbit in about 116 days, which is much faster than any other planet. This rapid motion may have led to it being named after the Roman deity Mercury, the fast-flying messenger to the gods. Mercury revolves around the sun at a speed of about 48 and 8,692 10,000 km per second. Round this number to the nearest hundred and thousand. To answer our problem, we're going to round it off to the nearest hundreds and thousands. In rounding decimal number, just like in rounding whole number, first is we're going to look at the rounding digit. We're going to round it off to the nearest hundreds, we're going to find the hundredth digit. So this is tens, hundreds. So the rounding digit is six. Then we're going to look at the right side of six, which is equal to nine. We're going to know if the right side digit is round down or round up digit. If it is round down digits, digits which are four and below, these are zero, one, two, three, and four, then the rounding digits will be remained. But if the right side of the rounding digit is round up digits, these are 5, 6, 7, 8, and 9, then the rounding digits will be added by 1. Just like in our example, the rounding digit is 6 and right of 6 is 9, 9 is round up digits, so we're going to add 1 to 6. Okay, 6 it becomes 7 and the left side digits of 6 we're going to copy and the right side we're going to drop. So our answer now is 48 and 87 hundredths. If we're not going to drop uh, 92, we are going to change this one into two zeros. It can be also but it is said that zeros after the non-zero digits are insignificant zeros. So we can cancel that one. We can delete these two zeros. Our final answer is 48 and 87 hundredths. Okay, next is we're going to round this number to the nearest thousand. We're going to find the thousand digit. So this is tens, hundreds, thousands. Nine is in the thousands place. So nine is our rounding digit. We're going to look at the right of nine, which is two. What is two? Up or down? Okay, it is in the round down digit. Okay, what shall we do with 9? We're going to add 1 or remain? Okay, we're going to remain because 2 is in the round down digit. So 9, still 9. Then the digits at the left side of 9, we're going to copy. Then 2, we're going to drop. So our final answer is 48 and 869,000. Okay, another example. We're going to round this number to the nearest hundreds and thousands. We're going to round it off first to the nearest hundreds. We're going to find the hundred digit. Okay, this is tens, hundreds. So the rounding digit is six. Then we're going to look at the right digit. What is right of six? All right, it is four. What is four? Up or down? Okay, it is in the round, down, digits. 
So, what shall we do with 6? Okay, 6, our rounding digits, we're going to remain. Okay, 6, it becomes 6 still. Then, the left side digits is we're going to copy. Then, we're going to drop the right side digits. So, our answer is 9 and 76 hundredths. Okay, how about if we're going to round it off to the nearest thousands? What is our thousands digit? All right, it is four. Okay, what is right of four? Okay, it is eight. What is eight? Up or down? Okay, eight is in the round up digit. So, what shall we do with four? Okay, we're going to add one. Four, it becomes five. Then the left side digits, we're going to copy. And we're going to drop eight. So, our final answer is... 9 and 765,000. Okay, this is the way how we're going to round decimal numbers to the nearest hundreds and thousands. If you like my video, just give me a thumbs up or click the like button. And if you are new in this channel, don't forget to subscribe and share this video. Until next time!